Oh my, oh my. What you've just seen is a lawnmower. A machine used to cut grass. And we have been here cutting grass in this massive area here since 6 a.m. It is almost 7.30 a.m. Beautiful sunrise as you can see the other end. Guys, I want to talk about this business idea of cutting grass using a lawnmower. For you to understand, there is a gentleman there cutting grass using a lawnmower. It is a profitable business. Watch the whole of this video and also remember to subscribe. Down below, click subscribe to join the family and also drop a like on this video. So, vila mbona, eh, shuguli ya kukata nyasi memalizika. Kuna zile clips mekua ni maonyesha kuhusu shuguli ya kukata nyasi. Na niko hapa na wale biashara ambao ningependa tulizungumza nao. Ndiyo weze kuelewa what this business contains. Yes. Ningependa kwanza uweze kushara na watazamaji. Eh, hii biashara mwilanza vipi na pia hivyo hivyo mwilanza kukata na vipi na wanyama. Ok, na shukuru sana kwa kusa hii. Hakika marafiki zangu ndugu zangu kika zilianza 2010 na hakika tulianza na mambo tu ya slasher tulianza na slasher tu na ndipo wakati moja tukakutana na mzee mmoja alikuwa anaitwa Njuguna hakika alikuwa na photocopy machine pale kwa DC pale na tulimfiekea na slasher kweli na akakubali na akafurahia akasema na kipi unaonaje kama tutaweza kutana na tupange ili kama tunaweza naweza wapatia machine ili muanzia hapo na mimi niwasaidie kuwa market na tukasema hapo hii idea si mbaya hakika tulikubali na tukafurahi sana juu hakika slasher zilikuwa zinatuchosha lakini kufikia ile wakati mzee huyo akatupatia machine hakika alitusaidia sana na akajaribu to market sana wateja wake wale wenye walikuwa wanakuja kufanyiwa photocopy kwake na anatu market hapo amechapisha manamba zetu za simu pale hivyo hivyo mpaka wa leo hakika huyu mzee alikufa lakini sisi bado tunaendelea na hii biashara na tunamshukuru sana maana hakika alitusongesha watu wengine yale ambao hatukuwa tunajua hakika tunamshukuru sana huyu mzee hata Mungu amlaze malipeni so one thing I have noticed about these gentlemen is that they are working together. In fact, they have been working together for about 10 years now. That shows you that partnership goes a long way, assisting you increase your income and also at least complement each other's strengths and minimize each other's weaknesses. Mwona mweza kutapai kazi kwa, kwa, kwa mbuda mfupi sana mkutumia machine eh? Eh, Na mbibu kuna mtu uko inje Anajuza suwali kwa mfano hii machine na naipata vipi eh, Mbibu kwa soka nizaipata na pisa ngapi Na maswali kama hayo Zado kwa nza mwambia vipi Hakika unawazi hizi machines Ziko market Hata bungoma hapa ziko mm -hmm. Ziko kisumu Ziko eldoret Na hizi machines unawazwa kwa pay ita for tafauti mm. eh, Machine yenye tunatumia saa hii ni ile inauzwa na 65000 65000 okay. watazamaji ile pale nyuma hiyo yeah. machine pale ndio 65k eh uh -huh. alafu yenye nafuata tuko na 50 tuko na 48 mm. tuko na 42 mm. na hata zile zinaitwa brush cutter zile tuko na za 20 tuko na 18 ziko mm. better for tofauti mm. lakini hizi maboma mingi maboma kubwa kubwa hizi Watu wengi wana prefer hii machine ya lawn mower. Juu lawn mower inanyorosha nyazi paspalam kama imepandwa. Hiyo ndiyo nafanya paspalam inatawala mbio mbio mbio. Mm. Inatambaa mbio. Lakini mm. ingine brush cutter na shida nkua. Inakata, inaruka semu zingine. Haifanyi nyazi inakuwa level moja. Mm. Sasa hiyo ndiyo challenge za hizi machines. Mm. Lakini zote zinasaidia. Hatuwezi kataa 
juu zote zinafanya kazi sasa. Na wanyama, yes. ningependa kuuza swali kuhusu kazi yenu. Katika kila kazi kuna changamoto. Katika hii kazi mapitia changamoto zipi? Ah, watazamaji vile mtu wangu anaongea. Hii machine vile kitu pale pale unaweza pata komba ni mawe iko mingi na hiyo mawe lazima kutifika tuokota. Usipookota unaweza kutoa hiyo mawe. La aidha ikuumiza ama ipike nyumba ya mtu ama iharibu hata gari yako. Ndio. Unaweza vunja ama glass, unaweza kufunga glass hata hata ikipata mtoto ama mtu yote kanda na ikati. Sasa kwa hivyo lazima tuokote mawe pale. Hapo sawa kabisa. Biashara mambo ni kwa vipi? Maana yake mmefanya kazi pamoja miaka kama kumi. E, biashara imekuwa vipi? Na kwa vile uniform throughout ama pia nimeanza kuona kwa biashara imepungua ama maybe wanasemanga katika soko lote kuna ile maybe wengine wanafikika wengine mambo yanakuwa mzuri kama ile imeongezeka. Iko vipi? Ah hii biashara watasemaji kuanzia mwezi wa 12 mfuo ikipungua. Kasi yetu huwa inarudi chini. Bati mfuo ikinyesha kasi tunafanya throughout vizuri sana. ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.ndakisikia.nd